We're going to paint and draw the wahoo today. The wahoo is a fish found in South Florida, warm waters all through the world. It's a fast swimming fish. It's very long. So we're going to start off with a nice long oval. And then we're going to do a long rectangle here and a big triangle down here and a long triangle in the front. It's a very long streamlined fish. Let's find our center right here. So we have, and I'll make it darker, we have our oval, our rectangle, big triangle, long triangle in the front. So let's start with our shape. We're going to go right here down our long triangle, almost to the end, then bring it in as it comes down a bit, come out just a bit, come out to the end of our triangle here, go right down to where we joined, and we're going to bring it up like that. It's got a very pointed mouth, long snout. Now for the rest of the body, we're going to follow our oval, keep coming down, and I'm going to just go like that. We're going to use that as a guide, but I'm going to go in um, to the tail like that and here follow my oval come up and go into the tail like that Then we're going to join right here and come up back and Over make a little line right there and that is where that strong pelagic tail will come in So we have our tail we have our body we have our face now for the eye Right where we had our mouth come down, I'm going to use that as a reference come up near the top of the head and make our eyeball. For the gills, we showed the one right here. Now we come up a little bit and there's another one right there, our gill cover. For our dorsal fin, come a little bit behind where we have our gill cover here. We're going to go straight up, down, and that's going to be the soft dorsal. And right behind that, let's just make a triangle for now that's going to be the second dorsal. Find that line, come down, and another one at the bottom. <clears throat> That'll be the anal fin. Right behind our operculum, our gill cover, we're going to make a straight line out and back. And that will be one of, on both sides, the pectoral fin. And even with this straight down, come out, up, and that'll be one, here's the other one, of the two ventral fins. So we have our basic shape. I did a little darker for you so you could see. Now we're going to clean it up. So come in with your eraser, get rid of your guidelines. You can see how it has a nice long streamlined shape. Wahoo are really prized for sport fishing because they're so fast. They're one of the fastest fish in the sea, sailfish of course being the fastest and they have very, very good eating. They are prized by gourmet chefs. Okay, so I just, my mouth came out a little bit more here and this is just a little bit shorter. Okay, so we have our basic. Now we're going to do our painting. I have my Reeves watercolor from my black to my white. I'm gonna start off three quarter inch brush and I'm going to get my dark blue in my tray. Dark blue. Using my big brush, I'm gonna start right up here and go right along the, out, the top. They are counter shaded, of course, dark on the top, lighter underneath. I'm gonna put a little black in there so I get it a little bit darker. Make another line coming down. Now the Wahoo have these stripes. So coming from here, and there's about 27 to 30 of them, I'm going to make these stripes coming down. We're not going to make all 27 to 30, but I'm going to make several of them coming down. There they are. And then getting it a little lighter, we're going to show a little bit of them coming up here at the bottom. I'm just pushing up with the bottom of my brush. Just an indication of it. Now with what is on my brush, I'm also going to use a side and make these short strokes to show how the fin goes. Also on the back one, same thing down here. And we are layering our colors, bringing it down here. And the ventral fin, same thing. And 
the pectoral fin. I'm also going to put a little bit of blue here at the mouth, a little bit here in the nose, a little bit on the under mouth, a little bit around the eye, a little bit coming up here on that um, gill cover. And let's just put a little bit on the tail, just a base color. All right, now I'm going to do a little darker. So I'm going to add some black with that dark blue and make it a little, it's a little too dark, a little more blue, a little bit darker here up at the top. That's the black with the dark blue. And start those stripes a little bit more coming down and a little darker on this second dorsal. And I'm going to, using my brush here, just show the beginning of the hard dorsal with that dark color and a little bit here on the nose with that dark color. I'm also going to make this fin a little bit darker, this fin a little bit darker. I'm just layering my colors here and a little bit here. All right, so now I'm going to put my big brush down. And I'm going to get my small number four round. And I'm going to go in with my black. Let's do the eyeball. We're going to make the eyeball leaving just a little bit of white and the outline of it. There we go. I'm going to get a little bit more of my dark blue. Define the nose here. Mouth comes in, down, and the lower mouth coming out. We're not really outlining, more like we are defining. And there's a bit of a piece that comes up like this. And we have our gill, there's one there, and another one right there. The water goes, you know, in the mouth and over the gill. This line comes up there. And a little bit of um, darker here under the mouth, just like that. I'm also going to um, put a little bit of darker color right here at the base of this gill. A little bit more around the eye. Now using the dark blue and black again, come up here to the hard dorsal and we are going to show those spines. So. We're making deliberate lines here for the spines. Of course, fish, these are a bony fish. Spines come off the vertebrae and extend into the fins. Then a little bit of a line here at the top. And it goes all the way down. Now for the hard second dorsal, not the hard dorsal, using that blue and black again, bringing it to a point. Now this one comes down a little bit and goes out just a tad like that. Now the other thing that the Wahoo have is the finlets, kind of like the mackerel and the tuna. So I'm going to make a lot of these little triangles all along the base here. All these little triangles on the bottom as well. Those are the little finlets. I'm going to make the shape, then I'll just color them in with that dark color. They're not a very colorful fish. It, the stripes can be a blue-green or a dark blue, as I've just noted here. And then the bottom here we're going to show again with a darker color, our spines, and in our ventral fin, spines as well. The two ventral to pectoral, but like all bony fish, only one anal fin and one dorsal fin. Now I'm going to rinse out my brush a little bit and um, put in a little shadow here and just a little bit of an underside sweeping through there. Now let's get back to our tail fin and I'm also going to put in the spines here coming off of the base spines. Use a full sweeping motion with your brush. And the last thing I want to put in a little bit of an orange that's just a highlight and we're going to put just a little bit of that, it's a little too dark, a little bit of that just coming 
just this area here on the fish, just a little bit that goes right through. A little bit up here around the eye. I'm going to put a little bit on this fin. A little bit here on the tail. Pick up a little color there. Uh, make sure it shows right through there. A little bit here on the anal fin. Just a little bit of orange for a highlight. Just a little bit here on the ventral fin. And I'm going to get just a little of my blue. Wash it off a bit. And show a little more roundness here on the eye. The lip. Darker. I don't want this too white here, so I'm putting a little bit of my light blue wash and I'm darkening up the gill. Gill cover. A little bit up there. And I'm gonna put just a little bit of orange washed out up here on the dorsal. The Wahoo again, fast. Great to catch for sport fishing. Found in all the tropical and subtropical waters of the world. Really good to eat. We have them here in South Florida. I'm going to just use a little wash to join these a little bit, a little bit with that blue. They're like stripes. Okay, so it joins just a little bit. Clean up the bottom right here. And we have our Wahoo.